how do I retarget the people who have opted out of pixel tracking? Let's just say that somebody comes to the website on their device, their mobile device. I probably can't put ads in front of them, but not everybody has. So I'm going to have a uh, specific um, retargeting campaign based upon page views of my website. The way that opting out of uh, pixels works is as soon as you leave the platform, let's just say Facebook, for example, you're on Facebook, you leave the platform, everything beyond that basically goes black. So Facebook doesn't know anything that happens after you click off because you have not allowed them to track you beyond their platform. Now, some people haven't opted out of that. So I want to run retargeting ads at those people who haven't opted out because that is good. No, I'm not infringing upon your data. I'm not, I don't know anything about your data at all. That's Facebook. That's Mark. You, your beef is with him. But I'm going to create this little vacuum so that if you come to the website, I'm going to put these ads back in front of you. That said, here's another way to think about this. Let's say that you have, or your customers have opted out, which is most people. Most people on an iOS device now, and this is gonna be true for Android as well. Most people who are on iOS have opted out of retargeting, but here's the kicker. Let's say we're on Facebook. Facebook still knows, or you can program it to know, right? That so-and-so left you, the, the platform to go to your website. So that as a marketer, you still know that somebody was on Facebook, they saw your ad, they clicked on that ad and then poof, everything goes black after that. Well then re-step or, re, or just back up to where that moment happened. So you can set up your retargeting for people who've opted out of like all of the, the pixel tracking and good for them. You can still build a machine to, to listen basically to those people who have clicked on an ad and left the platform and visited your website. So we don't know what actions they take on our website, but we can assume that they saw the ad, they clicked on it, and then poof, they left. So we can put ads back in front of those people. So your ROI probably isn't going to be nearly as efficient there as um, somebody who was, you know, as a page view on your website, but still the concept is sound. These people have been to your website already, or they've engaged with your ads already. They're lower down in the funnel already. Spend money on these people first, rather than going to the top of the funnel or sending your ads out to the nether, hoping that somebody needs that new route.